Alright, in this video, I'm going to show you how to install mods to act to the uh, Emergency 4 game. I'm running this on a Windows 7 computer. I have WinRAR installed on this computer. You need to make sure you first have WinRAR on your computer so you can open up the RAR file. Once you've got WinRAR and you installed it on your computer, and if you don't have WinRAR, I have the link in the description box. Once you've downloaded it, once you've installed WinRAR on the computer, you will, when you go ahead and you download the Manhattan mod or whatever mod that you're planning to install to Emergency 4. In this case, I'm going to do the Manhattan mod. And now that I've got WinRAR on my computer, I have these bookmark icons. So I'm going to open up the RAR file by double clicking on it. It's going to go ahead, it's going to load up the, the files. And then here you're going to see the actual folder for the mod. You're going to simply hold down the mouse button and you're going to simply drag it over to your desktop and let it extract its contents to your desktop. Okay, so once you're uh, finished extracting these files, just give it another few minutes here. It's a lot of files to extract. This could take a very long time to complete this process of extracting the files to the desktop folder. Just give it a bit and uh, it's 98% complete. Once that's done, we'll extract it to the right place on your hard drive and start up the game. Alright, so once it's complete, you'll notice there's a, the Manhattan folder on your desktop. What you want to do is you want to actually go over to your Emergency 4 file on your desktop. For some reason, I'm not seeing it. My eyes are playing tricks on me. But it's on here. Alright, so when you find the Emergency 4 icon on your desktop, you're going to right-click on that. You're going to go into properties here. You're going to click open file location. And in here, you're going to locate the mods folder. And you're going to double click that. And what you're going to simply do is you're going to take the actual mods folder that's on your desktop, go over it with your mouse, hold down the left mouse button, and simply drag it right into this area. Simply drag it. It's going to move the file. It's going to ask you probably for permission. If it does ask you for, for permission, just do so and let that actually move across. Alright, so once the file is in there, you're now going to start up E4 by opening up the icon on the desktop. Alright, so once you get the game open, head over to the modification section of the game. And there's the game, the Manhattan mod right here. You click on it, click OK, and you're going to have to wait quite a while for this to load. But once it loads, you can go in and you can play on it. At this point of the video, it's pretty straightforward what to do. So I'm pause. I'm getting to close this video out. So thanks for watching. Please remember to comment, write, and subscribe.